What's up, Twisties? It's Twisted Pandora, and welcome back to another event in the wonderful world of Roblox with your cyborg host and his trusty sidekick, Mr. Bob and Cybert. And today, you already know, we're going to take a look at this labyrinth event that just came out today. Mazes come in all shapes and sizes. They can be made of corns, mirrors, or hedges. They can take you down winding pathways, crooked turns, and twisting trails that lead to dead ends or, if you're lucky, a way out. But the one thing they all have in common is the feeling of excitement, uncertainty, and an urgent need to escape. Will you be able to overcome the labyrinths that await? Team up with your friends and complete the missions below to earn exclusive virtual prizes on Roblox from now until January 30th. So it's a random event. I thought it would be sponsored by something because it'd be labyrinth, like maybe a new Maze Runner movie or something. But I, I guess not. There's no... It doesn't say anything. Anyways, the prizes are Minotaur Mask, North Star Headphones, and Maze Glasses. So we have three games today, but only three prizes. It's not like the usual where you have two prizes per game. And the games are Parkour Tag, Flood Escape 2, and the Maze Runner. These are all wearable items. So unlike every other gosh dang event for the past half a year, they finally they listen to us, the community, and stop putting the dang gears. They're probably going to put that next event. But anyways, this one is all wearable in any game. You got your headphones. You got your mask and you got your glasses. Boom, everything you can wear. Awesome. I'm gonna wear this after too. You know what? Labyrinth, this is gonna be the new set of attire. I should make a labyrinth styled uh, shirt or, or something. That, that'd be cool. But, anyways, guys, we're gonna get right into Flood Escape 2. You guys know I love Flood Escape 2, so of course, we're gonna start with Flood Escape 2. What's the secret to making a maze even more difficult to navigate? Just add water. In the all new map, Forgotten Tomes, yes, a new map, thank goodness, you and your friends must discover a hidden switch to unlock a secret room somewhere within this ancient burial chamber but be warned the journey will be tougher and the water will rise fast well if that's the case that we had to do flood escape 2 it's all up to you the forgotten tomes is a normal map that that's easy right there here we go flood escape 2 let's get the show on the road ladies and gentlemen if you guys like the sound of this event already in our pump be sure to drop a like down below subscribe if you guys are new and welcome maze comes in all shit i already read this already get out of here on the new map forgotten tomes search for a hidden switch to unlock a mysterious room then complete the secret challenge within Ooh, ooh! not only do we have to complete the map there's also a secret within the map now that is cool. That that's really cool. I think Flood Escape One had a similar event where there was a secret realm, and that that was really awesome. So hey, what the? Am I the only one in here? What? Wait, no. There's people in this lobby, but not too many, and no one was in the actual place to start the game. I don't know why, but I guess this is a good start to the event. I mean, as long as I survive, we're gonna go to a normal, right? It's a walk in the park. I don't even need to be fast at this. I just can just chill around, just have some fun, because this water ain't gonna raise. It's not gonna hit me. Oh, now it's become acid. Oh no, I'm so spooked out, ladies and gentlemen. I'm gonna die. Wait, it's this way. You know how people usually like wait around here? Imagine if I waited. I don't need to wait. Let's just get in here right now. Difficulty increased to normal. Let's hope. Let's hope. Cross our fingers, guys, that we get the normal event map right away. Come on. Come on. Oh, we got descriptions. No, I didn't want descriptions. All right. Well, we're going to get this to the seas, to the sea, the sea, the deep blue sea, the deep blue sea, the deep blue sea. Hey, why is it still like built? What the heck? I thought we broke it down. Why is it still alive? I, I don't know. Anyways, we're going to go across here. Survive this easy jump here. Boom. All right. Well, let's see how many people survive. I I'm hoping it's not too many because I want to stay on a normal. Yes. Yes. We stayed on a normal. Forgotten tombs. Here we go, ladies and gentlemen. The event is here. Wait, is this the secret? No, that's not the secret. All right. Where do we go? <gasps> oh, no. We just had someone die. We just had someone die on us. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. What do we do? Guys, Fred, where do we go? Fred, where do we go? This is so cool. I love event maps. Wait, there's a button over there. We got to go press it. Go press it, sir. Go press it. Are you gonna go press it? Or am I gonna press it in time? Oh no, you're gonna go press it in time. Okay, that's fine. Where do we go now? What the? Oh, we jump back down? Oh shoot, oh shoot, it's lava! Ah! Just played an easy map, Axiom, so now we can go right back to Forgotten Tombs because we all failed last time's Forgotten Tombs. So here we go, make sure we don't fail this time around because if we fail, oh gosh, that's gonna be sad. But this time we know what we're doing, especially here for the event. Right now, Forgotten Tombs ain't gonna be forgotten anymore. We're gonna find out what is inside this tomb and especially get that special event item for today. The thing is though, we gotta watch out here. This, this part here is pretty tricky. We, we just gotta watch out. Out, especially for the sides there. What the? Wait, oh, 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 geez, that was close. The lava came out of nowhere. Okay, it's fine. It's fine. Now, where do we go? Wait, where, where do we go now? We just go over here? Okay, okay. Forgotten tombs? More like, I don't know where to go, tombs. Oh, there's a button. There's a button over there. Grab the button. Grab the button, because I know the lava is raising up so quickly. We got to go for it. Come on. Come on. Button. Activate. Where, where do we go now? We're in that. 
Oh, we go over there. Okay. Okay. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, oh, oh. oh wait. What's this? Secret? Secret? I don't know. Wait. Is it a secret? I, I can't get up there. Okay. Doesn't matter. All right. There we go. Now we got to get up here. Um, why did I stall? Why did I stall? This is not good. This is not good. Get the button now. Oh, the lava's gonna race. The lava's gonna race. The lava's gonna race. Oh, where's the secret? Was that the secret back there? It might be. I don't know, but I'm, I'm trying to get my way across. We might have to come back to this level again. I think we will have to. God. Oh, no. Oh, no. It's raising. Oh, the forgotten tombs. We survived. But where, where's the, uh, where, where, where's the, where's the event item? Where's the secret? Where's the secret? I know there was a secret. They sent a secret somewhere in there to get the item. Well, we didn't find it. Third time is a charm in Forgotten Tombs. And we're going to get the show on the road. But first things first, we got to jump across. Make sure we don't hit anything on the way. Then go up and hit this little tomb thing. So we got to find out where in the world is the secret, guys. Where do you think it is? I'm trying to think. It could be that crevice where we saw earlier where you had to jump up and try to somehow get in there. Or maybe there's another pathway. And we just found out that the button that you're supposed to press is right over there for the bonus event. And so what you're gonna have to do is jump across here, but you have to be very careful because you can jump into the lava. And then once you do that, you go across here, jump back up here, and then make your way over this way. This part is really tricky, but as long as you, oh, the guy hit the button, but what are you doing? You can just jump over here and then jump over here, get up, and the E, we did it. The maze was no match for you. You earn a virtual item for completing the mission. Now we gotta get out of here. Oh, 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 jeez, jeez Louise. And that's exactly where we need to go. Remember when I thought the event, the secret was up there? Oh, oh no, 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 oh, jeez. <laughs> well <laughs> yeah i didn't delete the mission but you guys know the rest of the map i did it once already completed it perfectly this time around though i showed you exactly where to go in terms of the event it is right down in the little crevice i didn't know it was there but i looked down for a split second and a third time's a charm because we got the event boom ladies and gentlemen and with that we should now have the minotaur head or minotaur head whatever you want to call it and bingo this is exactly what the minotaur head looks like well with a lot of the other things on top of it hey forgotten tombs again let's do this one just as a recap i guess fourth time's a charm if that's even a thing for <laughs> fourth time what so if you want to do this all your own it is definitely possible to do the event and complete the map all in one go with just yourself but if, of course you got to be fast remember this is a normal map and honestly it's probably one of the harder normal maps just because of this one ply oh that guy just fell into lava just because of one of this place right here this this tomb don't go on this one go on the left side the left side is the right one okay guys just to keep an eye out now we're gonna want to do remember it's in here you press this button here and boom there it is it's open sesame you go oh watch out oh my gosh the lava almost got me there okay now we just got to go press across this part right here also is a far jump so you got to watch out definitely Ooh, that was pretty far then you jump over this way make it across it's as simple as that look at that nice little recap for all of you guys and just jump right across and we got a bingo and there was oh the event is here again look at this e for events Woo! after you get that the first time you won't need it again the second time but now if you wanted to see me complete it as well on top of getting the event well here we go for the final run we're also going to beat this and ladies and gentlemen boys and girls bang and then we can go down here and bang oh this is awesome if only i knew this the first time around it would help me out a lot but hey you know, Flood Escape 2 is a learning game. You learn as you go on. You, the more you die, the more you know. The more you find out, or that's how it goes. Anyways, we have not only beaten the event, not only gotten the item, but we also completed the map that we needed to do. The difficulty will return to easy for everyone else, but for me, that'll wrap up today's episode of Flood Escape 2 with my monitor head. Now, it, again, it looks weird with my glasses on, my my headphones and everything, but if you take it off, it looks it looks like a monitor head. I don't know. Like, I want to say it looks good, but, I mean, monitors don't really look good. They're not meant to look good. They're meant to look like bosses. I, I don't know. If you guys enjoyed this event or enjoyed Flood Escape 2, be sure to drop a like down below. Subscribe if you guys are new to the channel. I am currently burning in acid, but the door is now open, but we're all going to die on this easy map. Also, guys, let me know what you think about a labyrinth-related costume. I don't know. The event is really short, so maybe not. Uh, it's just something out there. If you guys want to make a costume for me, by the way, let me know down in the comments below. Link me maybe on Twitter, a costume that you made that you think that you'd be looking good on me. Maybe something similar to this. I, I just want to see some fan-made costume creations, perhaps over wear it in one or two videos or perhaps a whole week it all depends on how good it looks and how much you rest of the fans like it but anyways later today there will be another event video and tomorrow will be the third one to wrap it up i really enjoy this event because we can have things to actually wear which is awesome and honestly this monitor head is pretty funny well until next event episode this is twist pandora signing off and as always don't forget to stay snazzy